Two in custody deaths in just two days in Conway. Thanks for joining us tonight at five. I'm Rolly Hoyt and I'm Faith Woodard. Questions remain as to what happened in both of these situations. THV 11's Ian Russell has been following both cases for us. He has the latest. Details are slim because both of these situations are still under investigation. Press releases from the Conway Police Department say they've asked the Arkansas State Police to look into this, saying it's standard procedure. We reached out multiple times to both CPD and ASP for any information, body camera video, anything about these two cases, but have been told that because they're under investigation, nothing can be released. So let's start with what we know. According to information from the Conway Police Department's Facebook page, this second death happened Tuesday. Police responded to the corner of South Center and Hardy Street in Conway for reports of a man going into people's yards and yelling to himself. When they got there, they say they found that man later identified as 44 year old Ricky Freiburg unresponsive. Officers say they asked for medical assistance and gave Freiburg Narcan. During this process, officers say he became combative and disoriented. They put him in handcuffs and when medics showed up, they took him to the hospital. Police say he died at 554 Tuesday evening. The other death happened Monday. The Conway Police Department's Facebook page says they responded to a domestic disturbance at McDonald's on Oak Street. Officers got there and say they asked 26 year old Dietrich Williams Jr. for his ID. He went to search through his car and according to the release, the officers cited safety concerns, asking him to exit that car before pulling him out. They say he then ran to Gum Street. Once they were there, officers say he showed signs of medical distress. This is a video sent in by a THV 11 viewer of that interaction on Gum Street. Williams was taken to a local hospital where he died four hours later. Again, we don't know what happened in those 72 minutes between officers responding and Freiburg dying. We've reached out to CPD, ASP, and I've called the city to see if the mayor was able to comment on either death. I was told that because ASP is investigating, there will be no comment at this time. We'll keep you updated when we learn more.